Y habrá ido, ahí está, ahí está, sí, sí. Ahí está, Tichen. Se nos fue, Tichen. Me quedé hablando sola. Yo bien emocionada pronunciando. No, I'm really sorry about the problems that I'm having this evening. I'm so sorry. I feel so uh, also, eh? frustrated. <laughs> But I try to be positive, okay? I know this is it is not in my hands. Okay, so what are the three ways in which we pronounce the ED or regular verbs? Mm -hmm. Irregular verbs. ¿Cuáles son las tres formas, the different ways, the three different ways in which we pronounce ED? ED, ED, I, ED. Esas son como las escribimos. But how do we pronounce it? Ah, that, sí, yeah, una con yeah. T, una con IRET, IRET. Ya no me alcanzaron a escuchar con, eso. La que termina con T, E, D y con D, E, D es. TIRI. Las terminan T, T. TITI, TIRI. Ya no me lograron escuchar, ¿verdad? Yo ahí, vea. No, se Bien, no trabo ahí. combinaban con eso. Es que se oía cortada, dicha. Sí. Yo la primer fila yo quedé con duda de esas, las que terminan con... D. Las que se pronuncian como que fueran una T al final. Una T. Uh -huh. Miren, ahí las van a ir aprendiendo con el uso. Yes, in the last time Cuando I yo did. aprendí inglés, la verdad, la verdad, no me enseñaron la pronunciación. No me enseñaron las reglas de la pronunciación, pero yo, las apre yo aprendí a cómo se escuchaba. Cuando ya empecé a dar clases, me di cuenta que habían estas reglas. <risa> y entonces yo se las enseño a los estudiantes, aunque a mí no me las enseñaron. Pero hay que okay. hacerlo, ¿verdad? Entonces, okay. vaya. If you want, just repeat after me, ¿ok? okay. With your microphone muted. Mm -hmm. One tip. Te lo tragaba. Four tip. Decide. Todas las que terminan con t or d. Al final de esos verbos, como need, want, start, design. Eso es como cuando le agregamos el ID, agregamos una sílaba más. Entonces, al pronunciarlo, será así. Want it, need it, start it, decide it. Y ahora, en todos esos verbos que terminan en... En... Sound. Entonces, al agregarle el ID, la pronunciación va similar a la T. ¿Ok? Por ejemplo, kissed, kissed, laughed, asked, stopped, watched, and washed. Así como que si quieren. Watch. <ríe> washed. Sí, van a tirar saliva al principio. <risa> Pero después ya se va haciendo normal en ustedes, ¿verdad? Ahorita es cuestión para que se lo aprendan y para que hagan énfasis que es el past. This pronunciation is very, very important. ¿Ok? For example, you can say, I kissed my mother yesterday. Or I laughed at the movie a lot. And the most common sound is the, the, así como que si quieren echarla, vea. <laughs> the, for example, closed, saved, traveled, opened, climbed. Así. Started. Sí, que, pero verdad que en una conversación yo nunca he escuchado que, 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 que utilicen esa, 
open the. Yo, cuando está en una conversación así seguida, eso se lo pasan tragando, solo dicen open y ya. <risa> Ah, es porque sí como les digo ahorita porque se los estoy haciendo énfasis, entonces para que vean cómo es el sonido se los estoy haciendo así pero ya luego se vuelve algo natural y normal en las conversaciones ya no, es que usted va a estar haciendo ese gran esfuerzo ¿verdad? <risa> para echando saliva ahí Sí, no, no, no. Pero ahorita sí es cara. para mostrarles cómo se pronuncia, ¿verdad? Porque hay algunos, estos sonidos no los tenemos en español. En nuestro idioma no lo usamos así. Pero en inglés, sí. Okay. So that's why. Capichi. Capichi. Ya estamos usando hasta italiano en la clase. <risa> ok. Any other question? Not a question. Okay, next activity. Next slide. Oops. Oops. Esto no quiere trabajar en mí. No se ve. Next slide. How to use simple past sentences and yes, no questions. Look at the words in bold and complete the sentences below. Vamos a ver these examples. I learned, I learned a lot. I updated my networking skills. I exchanged business cards. Luis didn't attend the seminar. Luis didn't exchange business cards. The simple past describes past events. Use the verb in the ED, B form, or base form for positive sentences. What is the correct answer? Use the, the simple past describes past events. Use the verb in the ED or ED, D form ED, or base form. Exactly. ED, ED. Oops. ED. or D form. Exactly. For positive sentences. For negative sentences, use don't or didn't. 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 And the base form. Base form. And the base, base form. form of the verb. Excellent. This is for, uh -huh. very good, very good. Now, questions. Did you enjoy the seminar? Did you make new context? Did Janet update her networking skills? Start a yes, no question about the past with do or did. 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 Yes, with did. Next, at the subject. Subject, yes, that's the formula. Followed by the base form. Base form. Base form of the verb and any other complement phrase. Yes, guys, you got it. Now you can talk about the past. You can ask questions in the past then. Excellent. And now, exercise. exercises, time to work. Complete the questions below using the verse in parentheses and then interview two classmates. Take notes of their answers. Combine short and long answers. Ahora ustedes van a hacer, uh, can you see the verbs in parentheses? Yes. You're going to use those verbs here to create the questions. For example, did you enjoy, did you attend to a seminar last month? Did you enjoy the seminar? And so on. So let's work on the questions, please. 
Y luego les voy a, les voy a asignar algunos grupos para que se puedan interview. Ok, interview and answer the questions. ¿Qué significa exchange? Intercambiar. Sí, y todos tienen que ser did you. Yes. <laughs> That's true. Bien fácil, ¿verdad? Hasta se extrañan, pues. Sí, porque es lo mismo. Did you enjoy the seminar? Did you meet new people? Did you learn something? Did you network in the convention? Did you exchange business cards? Okay, guys. Now I'm going to assign you in... A small group so that you can ask each other the questions and answers, okay? If you have any doubt or any question, feel free to send me a message, okay? To solve your doubt. Teacher. How, how a problem, teacher? <laughs> What's the problem? Teacher. No, bueno, como estamos acá con Matías, yo le voy a preguntar a Matías, Matías me va a responder como eh, yes. Y... Yes, okay. I did or sure. no, I didn't. I didn't. Oh, okay. I'm so okay, sure. Teacher. Eso vamos a hacer, va. Sure, I'm sure. That's true. Yes, that's right. Okay. 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 Entonces, hacemos cuatro. Solo tres vamos a estar en este grupo, teacher. Yep. Son seis, hagamos dos cada uno, ¿verdad, teacher? Está bien así. Yep. Okay. Comienza, Matías. Okay. <laughs> Nancy. 
did you o cualquiera o no puede ser necesario yeah, yeah, you choose cualquiera okay va yeah. did you exchange business t-shirt business 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 okay did you exchange business cards no uh, i didn't i didn't didn't i didn't mm -hmm. No, I did. I didn't. Okay. En canciones veo seguido la palabra didn't. Didn't. Okay. Eh, album. Yes. Did you meet new people? Yes, I did. Okay. Hello, okay. usted me pregunta o hago yo las preguntas? Hago yo las preguntas. Pregunta ahorita usted. Okay, vamos a ver. Matías, did you hobby the seminar? Did you? Did you uh, hobby? Enjoy. 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 Uh -huh. Did you enjoy the seminar? No. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Mm -hmm. Okay, Alba. A ver. A ver. Pregunta, Yamanita. Matías. Did yes. you. Pregunta, pregunta. Matías. Sí, 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 digan. Did you, you work in the con convention? Network. Ah. Uh, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Alba, falta una. Do you love a cycling? Esa creo que le hizo a, a Matías, ¿verdad? No. No, no. Alba. Alba, uh -huh. le dijeron, did you learn sometime? Um... Okay, in the, uh, these questions are about like a seminar. If you have attending like a seminar or a training in your work. ¿Han, han asistido a alguna capacitación o algún seminario en su trabajo? Pueden basarse de eso para responder las preguntas. Por ejemplo, today I received a training about how to use eh, extintores or fi fire extinguishers. Did, did I learn something? Yes, I learned how to use it because I didn't know how to use it. ¿Cómo se dice aburrido, teacher? <laughs> boring. Boring. Some seminars. It's boring. It's, it's boring for you. Yes. Bueno, cuando no es algo innovador. Sí, no. Es que puro viejito dan esas cosas. Que lo pongan a usted, ¿verdad? No, necesitan jóvenes. Usted lo va a hacer Ah, sí, no, yo cuando, cuando puedo dar eh, lo que yo conozco, yo chispa para eso. That's great. Ok, I'm gonna go to another group, ¿ok? Ok. Do you have any questions? <laughs> eh, sí, este, nos preguntábamos con, con Domingo que si hay, al verbo hay que agregarle ed o así en su, en su forma base. Yo les digo que es en la forma base. Así que déjame. Yes, that's right. 
Cuando es pregunta, Domingo, bien sí. fácil. Solo tiene que poner el did al inicio. El verbo no cambia. Y eso es todo. Es casi, el did entonces sería casi como el uso del do y das. Exactamente, que solo que eso significa la, la misma en regla, pasado. Es la, en es pasado. Uh -huh, en pasado. Y para okay. la tercera persona, el mismo did. Para la tercera persona. Ajá, en cambio en el simple present, the third person has to be does, right? Uh -huh. Pero en el cuando... pasado, no. Y las respuestas largas sería usando siempre, ya no sería usando did, sino que ya ocupo la respuesta el, el verbo larga pasado. es el verbo en pasado. Yeah. Sin usar did, sin usar did, va. Exactly. Es que como no, medio logré oír lo que está en el camino. Ay, sí, yo sé, lo, I saw you, you were in the bus. Sí. Ok. Ay. Usando, eh, uh, solo sería, I enjoy, entonces, en la, en las dos, I enjoy the Yes, seminar. I enjoy the, the seminar. Yes, I enjoy. Yes, I Ok, guys. Um, many as some people that have, have not participated this evening. Um, or I haven't heard you. Vamos a ver quiénes están por ahí que les gustaría participar. Salvador. Uh, did you attend to a seminar last month? Yes, I do, teacher. Excellent. Victor Salazar. Yes. Did you meet new people in the last training you had or meeting? Yeah, I did. Okay. Alfredo? Did you learn something? Did you learn something in the last meeting or training or seminar you had in your work? Yes, I did. Okay. Let's see. Alba Dinora, did you network in the convention or meeting or seminar you had? At work? No, I didn't. Okay, and the last person, Katia. Did you exchange business cards? No, I didn't. Okay. Okay, guys, it's 9.53, it's time for our wrap up. Okay, read about previous experience in business, events, or at work. 
Where did you go? What did you eat? Who did you meet? You are going to provide your answers via chat soon, and I will see your answers and provide correction on grammar and spelling. ¿Qué vamos a hacer entonces? On the chat, you're going to write about a previous experience you had at work. For example, the celebration of the employee's day could be, or a seminar, a training, or um, an important meeting. Um, what else? Uh, something that an, an important event in your, in your uh, company, business, organization, or work. Okay? Yeah? Be a chat. Please try to answer these questions. ¿A dónde fueron? ¿Qué comió? ¿A quién conoció? What did you do? What did you learn? Etc. Etc. ¿Ok? Dice, who did you meet? ¿A quién conoció? Meet es conocer. Yes. También reunirse. Encontrarse. Mm, ajá, es que ese, ese es lo que tenía duda. Ok, I, am, I will read your answers on the chat. And this is the last activity of today's session. The Eso homework, no you know, it's in the platform. Ok, dice no le saqué screenshot. But it's in your presentation, it's in the presentation I sent you. Ah, sí, cierto. Ok. No, no remember. Nice, Fatima. Yo también le voy a compartir, vaya. Balcones restaurant. On my work, I, at work, I had meetings always for problems. <laughs> okay, the meetings you have is to attend some problems. Okay, I went to customer services seminary with my coworkers. We went to Pizza Hut and we had a delicious breakfast. We ate eggs, beans, cheese, bread, and we drank coffee. Okay.
Oh, William dice que ya no puede entrar a clases. Qué mal. Before and antes, ¿verdad, teacher? Yes. Teacher, I yes, I is, I did. Para decir que. Así como lo he puesto yo. This week I met, I meet the president of the company. I met. Ahí sería met, Fatima. I ate soup, sería of meat before weekend. Ah. Meat de carne. Yes. M E A T. Sería I had meat soup. Meat soup before the weekend. Mm -hmm. He said last week I wrote with my sister. She lived in the United States. I wrote with my sister. ¿Qué quería decir, Marco? No, teacher. Porque dice, I wrote, escribí con... I wrote, escribí. Es, la semana pasada es, le escribí con mi hermana. Bueno, pero me faltó ahí que en inglés. I ah, wrote. Entonces, pasado. yo creo que mejor sería decir, I practice my English. Ah, right. With my English with my sister. With my sister, I practice. In the United States. Okay. I practice my English with my sister. The oh, box well. of meat. The box of meat, Fatima, is meat. Last week they made the vacation pay. Oh, that's nice, Salvador. So you got some money. What did you do with the money? Teacher, teacher, so long, yeah. Yeah, it's true. Um, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> coffee and cookies, an important media across teams with all my co workers. Coffee and cookies. I met the new human resources manager. Oh, that's nice. Okay, I know it's late. I'm sorry, guys, when we are doing the, I like doing this with you. But, Please say present or here, okay? Uh, let's see, Al Alba Dinora. Present. Alfredo Alexander. Present. Carla Maritza. Present. Carlos Gualberto. Cristina Roxana. Present. Domingo Alexander. Present. Fátima del Carmen Portillo. Present. José Matías. Present. Karina Yamilés. Present. Marco David Velasquez. Present. Mauricio Alexander. Present. Maideli Yudin. Estaba de oyente, ¿verdad? Nancy Lisa Rodríguez. Present. Rocío Katia. Present. Salvador Escobar. Present. Sandra Velasquez. Present. Víctor David. 
Present. Walter Daniel. Present. En William Pérez. Bye. Qué feo Bye. respondió William. Present teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to stay with Fatima. It was, a, it was a pleasure to see you. Thank you for making the effort. Van a ver que al final vale la pena el esfuerzo. No los conozco, pero los quiero mucho. See you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night, people. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Hello, Fatima. Okay, Fatima, I'm all yours. I am here to help you. But you are muted and I cannot hear you. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Mm -hmm. The topic of today was easy. I think today's topic it was easy for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So maybe what we can do is to um to practice our English, okay? I like to know more about my students. And it's a way in which we can practice, right? For example, can you tell me what you did today? But being very specific, for example, I'm gonna start, okay? My day started at 6 a.m., okay? I woke up, but I didn't want to get up. <laughs> so I was staying on, in bed, just thinking about the day, and also, I read one chapter of the Bible. Mm -hmm. I read the book of Jeremiah. I am reading the book of Jeremiah, chapter 21. Okay, after that, I prayed. And I got the, 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 the energy or the strength to get up. And then I... I put some vegetables to cook, right, for my lunch. And then I went to have a shower. After the shower, um, I went to check the vegetables, <laughs> right? <laughs> and, um, and finally, I got dressed and I got ready to go to work. There was traffic today, so I was running to work and um i arrived exactly like three minutes before the eight <laughs> and i started my class with the with the with the teenagers and we uh started today how to write a, a story how to write a short story and then um we had a, a training at 11 the training was about the use of fire extinguishers. Okay, and English. Yeah. I'm sorry? And English. Post. No, that was you in Spanish, it. okay. Uh -huh. I have fire extinguishers. Era de seguridad ocupacional. Ocupacional. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Como manejar incendios, okay? El uso de extintores. Okay. Then I, we had lunch. I had lunch with my with my friend at work, and we watched a movie while we were having lunch. <laughs> <laughs> After that, we rested for some minutes, and then we started to work again. In the afternoon, I I taught uh, two groups from two p.m. until five p.m. Mm -hmm. And then I went to buy some, some things that I needed at home. So I did some grocery shopping. Then my boyfriend was waiting for me because she took, he took me home this evening. And we had, we, when we got home, we, had, uh, we made some dinner. We made fried eggs, beans, uh, tomato sauce. And we have dinner together and then it was the time to the class 
So, and now I am here after the class talking to you. Now, can you tell me in detail all the activities you did today, please? Teacher, how can you do a lot of activity in only in one day? <laughs> Amazing. Well, mm, you know, at the end of the day, I'm very tired. But thanks, God. <laughs> I could make it. Okay. Okay, my day. I start my day at... Um, 5.30, I, I wake up and also I get up quickly because I have to, I just, I have only 45 minutes to be, to be ready to go to, to the, to the work because my husband doesn't want to wait too much <laughs> in the morning <laughs> so, uh, because also I have uh, I have to be in the office before seven o'clock because we have to start to work at seven o'clock so I don't have time to make breakfast and sometimes I just prepare a sandwich and and I and I take the breakfast in the in the office maybe in fifteen minutes mm -hmm. and at eight or eight thirty in the morning and because I I work today the day today was to very. Como se dice, estresante. 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 Because since the last Friday, we have the visit of the president of the company. And when he, he came to visit to us, the environment is to, <laughs> uh, how can I tell you? It's too bad. <laughs> it's stressful and every everybody is nervous everybody is hungry <laughs> and and we have to be like um como un soldado ahí firme <laughs> don't move don't don't laugh so uh, and that's why i have to work last Saturday, I usually work only from Monday to Friday, but this Saturday I have to work because we have the visit of the, the, the president. president. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So and we have we I I work this the last Saturday I I was working from seven to five o'clock, around ten hours. So, and you um, normally work from seven to from seven to fifteen. Picture, mm. siempre se me olvida. Quince a las cinco. Fifteen to five. five. Fifteen to five. From Monday to to Thursday, Friday. and on Friday, oh, um, Thursday. from seven to. 15 to 4. One hour so, earlier. To Thursday, we work 10 hours. And on Friday, we just work eight hours. I work in a factory. Mm -hmm. So the, the schedule is, is totally different to the, mm -hmm. to the other company. Because the, the, ¿cómo se dice la empresa privada? Uh, private company. Private private company, they usually work from Monday to Friday, but they work only eight hours per day, right? And they work uh, on Saturday, just five hours, right? So in the factory, we, that's why we make one, we make 
night, mm -hmm. high hour from Monday to Thursday. And on Friday, we just make eight hours. Mm -hmm. So and today I was, I, I can take my lunch in the time, in the, in the usual time that we take. I, I did the, I have the lunch one hour after the, after we normally, after we normally, normally have it. Oh, have it. So, um, but in the afternoon, ah, the, 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 the president leaves at two o'clock. And after that, every, everything <laughs> starts to work normally. But return to normality. <laughs> <laughs> but we have many work. Teníamos mucho trabajo resaltado. We had a lot of oh, pending work. Yes, a lot of pending work. I, ha I have a lot of pending work too. No, but but I mean the play the deadline is next week. So this week I have to you know, work hard to make uh, it. We will, we will finish next week this this model. No. Next. No, um, we, no, this is the second week. Four weeks are for each model. Exactly, four weeks. And this is the second one. Ah, okay. No, but from my other job. Ah, really? I have, uh -huh. <laughs> Yeah, but I try to, you know. You can. <laughs> yeah, I try to to organize my time the best I can. Yeah. And that's all my day. I I came to to the home at five thirty. I prepared the dinner. To my my it, children mm. <laughs> and after that I take the rest around 30 minutes and connect to the to the yeah and I could see you like I don't know but you look very active to this evening in this class today. <laughs> yeah, Maybe the Friday I can I can stay in the class. I, I tell to myself, this Monday you have to be on time and you have to participate more. Oh, that's great. <laughs> and you know what? Did you do something to your hair? Because you look more beautiful. Uh -huh. no, thank you. I wash my hair. <laughs> <That's funny>. Really? <laughs> oh, I saw you had got a haircut and also um, no, you have dyed your hair. No, I don't. I don't have. I didn't have time to make the the cut, but I need. Oh, okay, the haircut. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wow, it's it's pretty late, but it was yeah. nice to hear you. To know more about you, okay, Fatima. I hope that this is not gonna be the last time that we that we have the chance to talk. Okay, me too. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Rest well, please. Good night. Bye.